Hello friends, this is Throjan from Silen Software Bhuneshwar. So in this video, we will see how to download and install STS. So STS uh, that is Spring, Spring Tool Suit. So STS is a Java environment. We can say this is a Java IDE, Integrated Development Environment for developing Spring West Enterprise application and it is easier, faster and more convenient and the most importantly uh, it is based on Eclipse ID and it is completely free and open source. So let us see how we will download STS and then how we will install then we will get an environment where we can develop a spring based interface application. So spring tool should I will download in Google if I will type STS download and hit enter you see the first link spring.io slash tools you uh, will uh, what, uh, open that link and you see spring tools plus four for the version and you see so spring tool suit sts for linux sts for mac sts for windows is available so we are talking uh what, uh for windows operating system you see so 4.16.1 so windows x86 underscore 64 so this is the what sts for windows operating system and now i will click so once I will click a jar file, I uh, will download, it will take some time, already I have downloaded, so now I am cancelling that jar file, okay. So once you will download, then uh, you will go to uh, my, uh, what, your download options, so here I went to my download options, you see, so this is, so that jar file, what I downloaded, simply I will, uh, what, uh, uh, cut and paste or you can uh, what uh, copy and paste means my point is I will uh, bring this jar file and I will keep in a folder whatever you, you uh, want that is depend upon you and suppose I cut and I will go to in day drive and I have a soft folder related Java software folders in this folder I have kept all my Java related softwares and here I will uh, what to paste okay so now uh, this uh, jar file so i fetched in my d drive in the d drive i have a folder java softwares in my java softwares folder that i have kept so now i will uh, then what i will do then i will open so it may take some time then now i will open that jar file so it is uh, it may take some time you see that uh, it is opening so that process is going on okay so now 73 percent 77 percent that is going on it may take some time so that jar file now that i am opening okay so now it completed we will see so where where is my sts folder you see so when uh, that jar file completely so i opened and i got these files Okay, so one folder that I got, STS 4.16.1, now I will open, you see, so there is an executable file, so it is looking like Eclipse. So now we will open uh, this executable file, so now uh, STS environment will open, so here workspace, so that depend upon you, in which location you want to, what set so your workspace workspace means is the place where whatever you develop your spring uh, best enterprise application that application will assign in that location so you can change it also suppose uh, here i have uh, uh, what uh, set d but that depend upon you in d drive in a drive so that it depend upon you you can uh, create a folder inside a drive you can also put uh, uh, all put all the application in that folder suppose i here i will uh, what set d as my workspace and i will click on launch button so when i will click on launch button now sts environment will open so it may take time so you see so now my sts environment is opening and this is uh, what completely looking like eclipse environment and this is the environment where we can develop 
spring based enterprise application so here so there are so many options created jaha project create a new spring starter project import spring getting started content creating a project we can import a project so definitely this uh, environment uh, having lots of advantages for development of spring based enterprise applications so i hope everybody got the clarity in my next video so i will show you how to create a uh, what the spring boot project in sts environment okay so i hope everybody understanding correctly thank you